So my free go-to licks are simple. It's uh, three notes in three different positions. So all based around the, um, the minor pentatonic scale. So the first one is in the first position, the second one is in the second position, the third one is in the third position. And it's literally just moving each step up. And some people, you know, get so wrapped up about the pentatonic scale and what they can do. So this is a really good way of interlocking between all of them. So I'm just playing these three notes in the first position. And the various I'll do between them is bending up or bending down each note. The second one. Third one. Uh. So in concert that'll be something like so all sort of around that sort of moving up there. So it's instead of getting locked in one position. There's a couple of nice turnaround licks and, uh, and secrets that I've, I've found through um, listening to great blues musicians like Albert King and Albert Collins and um, and BB King, all the kings. What they do is is they hit the note that you end on, so you, your ear can hear that chord change, even if you know I'm playing without a band. So you got something like if I go from the turnaround. <laughs> First chord. That note that you can hear it. So I'm always hitting, ending on that sort of the last note, which is the fifth. There. And what's really nice with this is you can mix the major and minor pentatonic together, which is uh, sounds nice on the ear, so you got Cool. Thank you very much.